Yo, hello everyone. Are you trying to choose between Spot or Printify for your print-on-demand venture? In this detailed comparison video, we'll explore the features, product range, and the pricing and the full payment options offered by both platforms. So, let's get started and choose the best one for you. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have full experience. So, guys, this is Spot platform. Right after you create your account, make sure to verify it. So send verification code to your email. Make sure to do that as well. And you will receive an email in your account. So here we go, copy this, paste it over here to complete your verification. Now, the good thing is this pod has its own store. So as well as some other applications like Printform, Printify, you don't really you have to connect it with any other store to publish your products but you have the access and the permission to do so and the their platform or the dashboard is pretty easy to use here as well they give you some of the tour and how to actually complete these steps and these steps are actually pretty much important for your account so it can has a product it can have payment information so you can receive money on your bank account and finally here you can have an order sample so you can check your product quality by your own so you, you make a design you order it of course you'll have to pay for it they will not send it for free but it will be less expensive than it will be costing for others, of course. And then you can actually think, am I going to actually invest in this or not? Now here, let's start with creating a product. All you have to do is simply either click on here or come over here on the left bottom corner, click on add product. And here you can choose to add your products on your own store. So here I have other stores connected to my spot account as my Shopify or my other store. Here I'm going to click on continue so I can only publish it on my main store, which is on spot. So first of all, this is the hoodie. This is a hoodie or a product that I am going to actually start editing on. You can here choose the product that you would like to start using as your template. There is so many stuff from clothing, accessories, home living, war art and new products. You can go through this, baby clothing, bottoms, polo shirt, etc. Uh, here as well you can find accessories, here home living and much more. And basically now I'm going to close this since I have a hoodie here to work on. So to upload any kind of designs, you can just work on with their own designs. So you have a big library here of designs that you can work from. You can even search by keywords and find the hot topics from here. Or you can just drag one of your designs by uploading it right over here. For me, I have already added like a text here. So here it is, I can move it around as I like, I can make it small, big, so it is fully adjusted as you might see here. So I can put it wherever I want. You can even add a design in the hand, shoulders, uh, the head of the hoodie and the back of the hoodie. Here as you might see, you can find the different kind of colors. There is the grey one, this one dark grey, dark grey and then the black one. Here some product info that you will find in the description of your product. So they give you a description with the images in it and table that will explain for people how is it created, what materials are in it and much more. Here the pricing details and as you may see here this is the, by the base price. So this is the cost of creating of this hoodie. This is how you will have to pay in order to create this hoodie without your design with your design I mean and now for here you will have to add the description which is you will have to copy it from the previous page here the pricing so here as I said this is 22.4 this is the production cost but yet you don't have read really the profit so you have to add here a couple dollars in order to make some profit so the retail price for example if you are going to make five dollars profit it will be at 27.43 let's make it around 30 which is gonna 
give us 7.50 US dollars as a profit. Here click on next. Here make sure to choose the product size and product colors. It's okay to choose other sizes since it will uh, like improve your chances of selling one of your hoodies. And then click on complete and everything here will be created successfully. Now, if you'd like to publish this product that you have successfully created on other like stores, you can click on here to connect integrations and then you'll find here different kind of platforms as uh, Spot API which is the current store there is Shopware, Magento, WooCommerce, Squarespace, Shopify or you can go straight to Autodesk where you are going to find all the platforms as Walmart, eBay, Etsy, Amazon, even TikTok I don't know what TikTok is doing on this application but you may also connect it to TikTok and publish your own hoodie on TikTok. So this is pretty good an advantage for Spot. And that was it for Spot. Once you open it, it will be on this dashboard. That's here, as you can see, I have completed some of the checks to do before completing my account creation. So the first thing that you might need to do is create your first design or design your first product. So to simply do that, you either click on this button that will be showing on here. For me, I have created one already. So in your case, I'm just going to go to the catalog where we can find all kinds of things that we can put our design on. So here we can find men's clothing products, women's clothing, kids clothing, accessories and home living. And each one of these categories has have their subcategories right below them. So you can have a bunch of options that you can make your cre creativity at the top of it. Now, as you can see, all you have to do to start designing, just choose for example men's clothing and then you can here filter them as you'd like from the color into the print area print providers and the sizes and the print type brand fulfillment locations so let's start with the color we can here click to show more and they will show you all the possibly been uh, printed colors so i'm going with dark gray for the moment and i will choose for example uh, all over print or front side sleeve left you can see something like that all right let's go for example on this one so here i'm going to click on it and then we'll wait until it loads for me it will not take that long and simply after it opens you will have here all the details about it from the pricing so this is the cost for it in each of these locations so you will be choosing which kind of manufacturer you'd like to start producting this product on so this one will be shipping for $4.99 this one for $7.99 and yeah it varies depending on which country you are going to choose from and each one has its own uh, like options and advantage so let's start for example with choosing this germany location i'm going to design and start designing on this manufacturer so here you can add design from your device custom text shuttered stock dropbox Google Drive or even hire professional designers on Fiverr that Printify will suggest to you. So you can also guys if you didn't know get an apply as a job on Fiverr and be like a freelancer when they do a partnership with Printify so you can start designing for their customers. So now let's go and click on my device since I'm going to drag images from my PC. I'm going to drag for example this create an image. Uh, I've been using it those, those days so I'm going to drag it here. As you can see you can move it around the chest so right left as I like. I can put it whatever I like. You can even add another design so it will not be one design you can here add some filters into it some adjustment to it create a pattern if you'd like so you can make multiple images in the middle so it is really really useful for you 
in general this is what you will need in order to create kind of a design once you feel like you have created it successfully you can even check the back side and add the logo to the back side and then click here to save the product as you may see here then they will take you to this page where you have to go and fill all the needs for you to complete your creation of this product first of all you will need a gallery images of this product so we will have to need to add some kind of people with it so it can be an example for people how it looks like on a real body i'm going to choose this guy and this girl for example then here we can go all the way down to choose and select the title change it to whatever we'd like change it to our brand name and then for the description we can go here and change it to whatever we'd like you can even try ChatGPT as a provider for those two things if you'd like to of course for here now we can choose from here the retail price so it is uh, for 36 so we can't really change it but we can change the profit so it's gonna profit margin by percentage so you can change it to whatever you'd like or go straight to here and make it whatever dollar you'd like so for example you want to make ten dollar profit five dollar profit it is all up to you once you finished with all of this you can ha you have to connect with publishing settings so you have to connect the store uh, you can click here simply to connect the store they can you can actually like connect it to your Printify store. So there is store on Printify itself. So you don't really need to go to any other application to make a new store, etc. Which is a really big advantage for Printify. You can simply, for example, click here and connect it. You can either choose Shopify or eBay. Now let's connect it to our account here, launch pop-up store, and then your account, your store shall be published and your product shall be published on your store as you may see here. So all of these things must be published on our Printify store without any problems. And that's how you can use Printify. So guys, that was it for today's video. That was the brief about these two applications. I hope you decide which one is better for you and see you guys in the next tutorial.